It's time now for Inside NAU's Mitch Stroman with Lumberjack and Olympian Lopez Lamong. So Lopez, first of all, welcome back to Flagstaff, to Northern Arizona University, but you're back as a student now, going back to classes. Talk a little bit about why you came back and what you're studying and what the, what the goal is here at NAU. Well, the, basically the reason why I came back because I, th there is a chapter that I, I left without not finishing, which is my education. Uh, my degree is the mo most important thing to me at this point. So I, it just feels so good to be a student again. Feel good to be sitting in front of, a, you know, the classroom and asking questions and, you know, writing, taking notes and all these things. So it's really a great thing. And I had a lot of energy um, to be able to be a student again. Lopez, mm -hmm. what are you studying here at NAU? I studied the uh, HRM or Child Restaurant Management. Mm -hmm. The reason why I chose that because um, I would like to get that degree and and go back to go to Sudan also to um, just to build like kind of a, a hotel there to bring uh, tourists to be able to come visit my country, uh, country of birth and, and just to be able to learn culture and you know the food and all these things so I, I think it's, it's a tremendous thing and I, I, I enjoy the, uh, enjoy the uh, program, it's, it's fantastic. And you're about to embark on getting your training going for the 2012 Summer Olympics in London, are you not? Absolutely, yeah. Summer Olympics in London is is on the way in the morning, 6 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> so you got to weave that in with your class schedule. Yes, I mean my class schedule is really, really good. I started in the mid morning, mm -hmm. uh, all the way until 6:45 at night. So it's really, really, it's a perfect schedule that will allow me to be able to do everything that I needed in the morning and everything that I needed in, in the evening after, after my classes, so it's perfect. You know, it's interesting that you say that that's the most important thing for you because here's, I'm talking to a guy that carried the United States flag for the U.S. Olympic team in the Summer Olympics in Beijing. I'm talking to a man who's won NCAA championships, who's won U.S. track championships. Y you are a champion, you are a runner, uh, and that's what you do for a living. Right. But you're telling me that even more important than all those things I just talked about is finishing your education here at NAU. Why is that so important to you? Well, like basically running, running is something like it comes and go. And uh, being two-time na national champion in the U.S., um, it comes and go because all these records can br be breaking. Um, top five, top ten in the world. But the most important thing is when I get that education, I value myself more than all these, all those credentials because it's something like it's so important in my family. I'm only one in my family ever went to school and I'm setting that goal and the bar, raising the bar high for my brothers who are when I went abroad from, from Africa to say running is not just you can make all money you want in running but if you don't have that cushioning in degree you, you know it, you 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 don't even know how to manage your money or you don't know even where you know how to use it so that's why i came back and also started training here at home it's a place i call home and all these trails that i've been running since 2005 it's still the same trails in 2010, and uh, so it's, it's just great. So there's a comfort zone here in Flagstaff. NA, NAU, as you, you must say, it's your home. You, you, you view this as your home, right? I mean, basically, it's, this is where my, my dream came true because, yes, I ran in, in, in high school, and I didn't even make it. You know, I, I probably I went to national champion in cross country, but this is where I, I won the NCAAs and I, br I brought, you know, I brought the uh, NCAA trophy back in Flagstaff where it belongs. And, um, and also um, going back and be able to make the Olympic team because now it's, it's good that I, you know, I, I call myself an, a lumberjack because I would like to call myself also another name called alumni lumberjack because um, it's something that is so good, so powerful that you have to have a place, you know, you, you, you know, you come home.